hey y'all, it's Night Strike here, and uh, yeah, uh, look what I got. Look what my brother got me. He got me a Super Nintendo Classic Edition. Now, I won't lie, I've already opened this up, but, because I had to check to make sure it worked, otherwise I had to take it back, because, believe it or not, these things aren't built the greatest. Yeah, it says, used to, made in Japan, yeah, more like made in China. Anyways, so I have opened it up, comes with a manual, right there, comes with a manual. I've already taken one of the controllers out, so just deal with it. As a Nintendo branded, Nintendo branded charge cable, USB charger. That's because, well not charger, but USB cable. Because it is powered by the same cable that my Raspberry Pi is powered by. A mini USB cable. See that? So. <clears throat> The eject button does not work. The reset button does work. Power button works. And on the front. The cables go in the front like that. I thought that was pretty cool. I'm still going to do a Raspberry Pi video of me doing this with a Raspberry Pi because, well, I like this. This is cool. I've got an idea for a Raspberry Pi to be even cooler. Or just that's cool. So, that light does turn on. So, there you go. There it is. Put that back in the bag. Well, uh, as I said before, it's got micro USB HDMI out. Uh, what else? It kind of does come with an HDMI cable if you need it. Uh, this is the controller. HDMI cable! Comes with one HDMI cable. Score there. There's the controller. So. Well, I'll put this back. in here and I may do a video later on don't hold your breath of me putting in it putting in it together and uh, playing it but as I said earlier don't hold your breath so there you go There it is. Well, thanks for watching. See you next time.